Hello and welcome to this edition. In this edition, we will examine a use case of Chart GPT and Python by a Chartered Accountant. Let's start straight away. One of the SSEs received a notice from the Income Tax Department asking the SSE to explain the source of fixed deposits made by him. The department has received information under code number CIB403 that the SSE has made certain time deposits exceeding rupees 2 lakhs with a banking company and the bank branch is Madhapur and the bank is ICSA bank. The total fixed deposits made by him is rupees 26 lakhs 19073 as per the notice received by the SSE. Now, now the tax consultant need to find out as to whether the SSE has really made those deposits and seek the explanation from the SSE with regard to the source for the same and he has to make a representation to the department. Now, if we examine, let me open the bank statement of the SSC. This is the bank statement of the SSC. Now here, from the bank statement, we can examine that certain fixed deposits are made. This is in the first page of the deposit, uh, of the bank statement. Also, on the second page of the uh, bank statement also, you have certain deposits made. Now, it has been observed that the SSC has made fixed deposits of more than the amount stated in the notice. In fact, these are all the deposits that have been taken out from that bank statement and we can observe that here the total uh, of the fixed deposits made by the SSC amounts to 46 lakhs 62,110. Now, as a tax consultant, out of curiosity, we should understand as to what are all the deposits that have been picked up by that CIB code number 403, which will total, which will total to the amount as given in the notice and the amount given in the notice is rupees 26 lakhs 19,073. Now, what uh, we need to do in this situation? There may be other possibilities, but uh, one such possibility wherein we can find out those combination of fixed deposits made which will total to 26 lakh. What we will do is we will take all, all these uh, items. So these items uh, the number of items here are around 22 items. Now let me select all these uh, 22 items, copy them. And what I will uh, do is, I will go to the chat GPT. For that, I will open Safari and uh, I will go to chat GPT and ask the chat GPT a question that is, the question what I am going to give is, first of all, I will copy all these amounts and then ask the chat GPT that these are 22 amounts. Find out those amounts which will total to 26 lakhs. What is the exact amount? Let me check what is the exact amount as given in the notice. 26 lakhs 19,073. 26 lakhs. 26 lakhs. 19,073. And press enter. Now the chat GPT has started responding. And what it is stating is that to find out the combination of these amounts, which will total to 26,19,073, you can use a brute force approach by trying various combinations. 
since there are 22 amounts you can create a program or a script to generate various combinations and check if their sum equals to 26 lakhs 19073 and here is the python script to do that so the script has been given by the chat gpt itself it is not that you being a chartered accountant need to know what is a python code how to write a python script or how to run a python script nothing is necessary just what you can do is copy code and run the python script how to run the python script you go to youtube browse the youtube and uh, there are a, a host of uh, videos wherein you can uh, learn as to how to run a python script and it is very simple if you are on mac go to the terminal open the terminal and uh, go to python python 3 terminal has opened and uh, just paste the code here and press enter now the script has been executed and it has given a combination it has given a combination of certain numbers now let me copy the combination of these numbers let me copy the combination of these numbers and again go to excel again go to excel and let me paste it here now it has given the combination of various numbers which will total to the amount of 26 lakhs 19073 now for saving time what i have done is i have marked all those amounts here and wherever asterisk mark is given that has been identified that is 2 lakhs 500 thereafter 2 lakhs 508 thereafter 2 lakhs 510 thereafter 2 lakhs uh, 501 is another number here now what we will do is we will try to select these items go to data and apply filter and find out all those amounts wherein the asterisk mark is given apply filter so these are the amounts the combination of which will total to 26 lakhs 19073 now let me check if uh, it is true so it has given uh, around 13 numbers so out of the 22 it has selected 13 whose total will be the desired total of 26 lakhs 19073 let us check what is the total yes 26 lakhs 19073 so friends sir, to the give the reply, the tax consultant should at least know whether the information received by the department is true to its full extent or did the department receive the information in bits and pieces. So friends, I thought uh, this is uh, one method by which uh, you can use ChatGPT and Python in your day-to-day -day practice now you can improvise upon this idea and if you find any other use cases of a chart gpt and python that can be used by a chartered accountant in his day-to-day -day practice do write in the comment section of this video thanks for watching see you next time